what is up okay yes what is up y'all um it's late at night you know what i'm saying but if you didn't read the title all right this is what the video is about all right so the card for you guys of course i did have a pile for y'all okay so somebody has commitment issues or they're afraid of commitment aquarius okay sorry you guys i have not been playing the music in the background because my tv has been acting real bougie like it'll play every other show i want to watch but let me want to play some music on youtube this shit be skipping like it's only no wi-fi so i don't know aquarius but we're gonna go ahead and get right into this reading you guys okay i'm so excited to do y'all reading i feel like i haven't done one for y'all in forever if you can't tell, a bitch got on her vine. It's a night time. It's a night dizzle. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get right into this, y'all, because let's see what's going on. All right. But um, I want to let you guys know. Um, thank you guys for liking this video, commenting down below, subscribing, turn on your post notifications. Okay. Um, but yeah, you know it's a vibe over here. All right. If you didn't get that forty percent off sale, you can go ahead and check that out on all the jewelry, bracelets, things that are in nature. All right, I do have mine on, all right, and go ahead and check out all the other, you know, things, okay, all the, all the, um, yeah, y'all, yeah, mine is everywhere, okay, because I'm doing a lot right now, but, um, yes, 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 let's get into this reading, y'all, because I want to see what's going on, somebody here is scared of commitment or afraid of commitment here, of course, but we're going to see what's going on with this person, okay, or with this situation, it's going to be a friend, you know, this could be like a friend that you know, or like somebody who wants to be a friend turned lover, a friend, um, a, a lover or something, you know. This is your reading, so you know, this is a general reading. I'm just here giving you guys the message. But let's get into it, you guys. Also, if you want to book your own personal reading, I am booked for today, okay, and tomorrow. So you might want to go ahead and see if you can get a reading for this week. But let's get into this, y'all, because somebody here is afraid of commitment. I don't know if they told y'all. But I'm just, I'm finna tell y'all what they told me, okay? But let's see what's going on here. I am going to use my gold tarot deck here. Let's see. We're going to go ahead and use this. This is one of my favorites, actually. Um, let me try to see if I can do this music for y'all one more time. But y'all, like, the music has not been working. Like, like it'll start playing a little bit and then it won't play at all. Like, it'll play an ad, but it won't play at all, like... I don't know, y'all. Shit is very fucking weird. But let's see. Because somebody is afraid of commitment. <laughs> like this video. Comment down below if it does resonate. This could be half your story, part of your story, 50%. All right. Simply have a message in here for you regardless of your sign. Okay? But what card is this? So we have the six of wands reversed. So like I said, somebody is scared of commitment. Either they feel like things are going to work out. Or this will not be a success. Or they do not. I'm hearing they're not looking at the positives here. Or, you know, they haven't had successful relationships in the past. Or success in love. All right. We have the page this worth reversed. This person could have definitely been a victim of, like, some type of, um, I don't know. I'm hearing, like, gang violence. Not, like, with guns and stuff. But, like, gang as in, like, social social violence here like gang stalking or like gang hating smear campaigns or like people ganging up on them or like you know just things not going their way here we have to pay the sports of birth so this person here i'm getting like um they have a fear of people talking about them behind their back not liking them or like not being up front but we have the aries card reverse here so like i said this person could be operating out of their lower energy or you know they don't feel like the emperor all right even though you could see them as emperor male or female emperor empress you know um, I'm the biggest boss that you've seen thus far. But they may not feel like this, Aquarius. Um, yeah, we have a ten of wands reverse. They feel like, um, you know, they're scared of commitments because they don't want to bring their burdens here. They feel like they're burdened some here. Or they don't want to be a burden to somebody here. So they have you as an empress, but this card did come out in the reverse. So this person here, they could feel like they're not worthy for some of you guys. All right. But yeah, we have the Queen of Cups here. They're, they're currently viewing as the Queen of Cups, men or female. They're viewing somebody here who I'm getting you have a mother's love, or I'm hearing only a mother could love. But this person here, they're viewing you as somebody here who, how do you say, um, when you love them, when you deal with them, it's a certain way. Like, I'm getting things are just, how do you say, different. They're more intimate, or they're more, I don't know why I'm hearing diving deep. Like, you know, they can be like very depth filled, or you know, there's a lot of substance to the con connection, or you yourself. But I have the death card here. I'm getting like, also, this person here, they want to put an end to. How do you say any type of situation that it had in the past? Here I'm getting with the death card here. Um, they're having a new beginning here, but they're just having second thoughts here. This could be like a relationship you're currently in, one that's coming towards you, or one um 
that is resurfacing from the past. But we have the King of Wands reverse. Um, this person here, I'm getting like they may view you as the King of Wands. Everybody's saying that you're the King of Wands here. Like you like a lot of attention here. Like you're like a Casanova, Casanarita. All right, but all in all, you are the fucking emperor here. All right, yeah, I'm getting this person here. They're not very confident in themselves, or they're not really self assured here. We have the Queen of Wands reverse, the King of Wands reverse, and the Queen of Wands. You guys could be marrying each other for some of you guys. So you go by, I can't even talk. You guys both may be, um, how do you say, afraid of commitment, okay? Or you know, you guys are both looking at each other the same way. You're the Queen of Wands, he's the King of Wands, but it's in the reverse here. It's like y'all want to act like one way, but like in reality, y'all are both scared or frightened. And I'm here, like your inner child creates solace in each other for somebody out there. But I have the Three of Swords just came out here. Three of Swords, Seven of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles reverse. So, wow. So, Aquarius. There is, so with the situation here, this person is afraid of commitment because of the seven of pentacles. Either you're not moving fast enough, they're not moving fast enough, or they're trying to move strategically here. But I'm getting with the three of pentacles reverse. They could have been in the past some type of strife or, you know, hurt or I'm hearing animosity or somebody working with somebody here. And I'm hearing not faithfulness or shady shit going on. Because we have the three of pentacles reverse. This is my card. How, how do you say motherfuckers be doing shit behind the scenes somebody could definitely be having like old memories here that make people do this i'm getting flashing out okay but some of you guys know all of you but this is the warning here somebody is being warned not to fuck this up or not to fuck with somebody here i'm mean, not to fuck with them but not to how do you say um be on the bullshit by spirit yeah we have the six of wands reverse in the um queen of pentacles let's see what this is about okay yeah whoever this person is i'm getting like they want to bring you off or they're like they're a knight but you're a queen you know queen king and then they're a knight here. They want to, how do you say, provide for you. Um, I'm hearing that song, She Ain't You by Chris Brown. I think that's what it is. She ain't, no, she ain't you. I think that's how it goes. And he ain't be doing all that extra shit. Oh, all the um, ad-libs and shit, y'all. <laughs> but, um, yeah, this is what's going on here. But I'm getting this person here. They want to bring you off, but they feel like they'll be unsuccessful or they feel like they don't have enough. So they're scared of commitment because they don't feel like they don't have enough here or they don't provide enough substance or I'm getting like they're just not enough for you. They have self-esteem issues or, you know, they they were, they rather wear a mask and dress it up and make it look real for you. Yeah, we have the five of wands. Also, they could be coming to bring you a cup here, but they also could come with a little drama or conflict here. Or um, somebody is very no-nonsense here. This could be you and the other person, but somebody is not like drama or competition here. Or this person here coming to bring you an offer, but they feel like you're going to have them in competition. So now they're scared of commitment here, Aquarius. All right. Yeah. Strength card, Leo energy. Like I said, this person here, um, they could feel like you are living in your ego. Or, you know, they need to have an ego death here. Or, you know, they're just not very confident here. They could feel like Beauty and the Beast. Are you guys like Beauty and the Beast here? It's kind of beautiful, actually. Oh, we have the death card, Scorpio energy, and the pages for the verse. So, like I said, this person here, they could definitely have their guard up here, or you do, all right? Um, that's what's going on here. Yeah, but we have the two of cups here. There definitely is some type of um love, um, mutual connection, all right? Um, yeah. I heard that song, Teenage Love Affair. Hey, 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 hey. So I can call your number. Time to pick up the phone. Like that. But I have the star card reverse. So here you are, Aquarius. So I'm getting like, you don't have faith in this or you don't trust this connection. It's like, I'm hearing something that's very airy, um, carefree, or it could feel very false, but it feels so good. All right. Yeah, let's get another card on that. Yeah. So this is how they view the star here. They are your biggest star, your biggest fan here. They know they're in competition, but they do not care. I'm getting like the, the connection that you guys share is very um different here with the seven of wands. You guys both may have obstacles in your path here. I'm getting like together, you guys are both unstoppable for some of you guys. And for some of you, this person here, they have a lot of obstacles or things going on in their life here, or things that they you know they have to take care of. I'm hearing grow out of or you know, evolve from. But we have the king of swords averse, the king of pentacles averse. Hold on. Push pause on the play. Somebody could have more than two offers here. We have King of Swords, so it could be Aquarius with Gemini. All right, we have the King of Pentacles reverse. So Capricorn Virgo Taurus, and we have a Cancer here. So three, the Thieves. I don't know. I'm hearing Thick as Thieves or the Three um, Musketeers or the Three Thieves. What card is this? The Magician card reverse. So somebody here could be playing both sides here, Aquarius, or somebody could be scared of a commitment because they feel like you get a lot of offers here. And we have the Page of Cups at the bottom of the deck. God. So somebody can feel like you get a lot of offers here or you them, okay? Yeah. 
I'm talking about this person is a knight. However, they feel like you got two kings. One of these one of these kings or offers that you have here for some of you guys. See, if you if you have a lot of offers, this is a message for you. If you don't, give me a second, I'm gonna get to you. But if you have a lot of offers here, we have the King of Swords reverse. This person here feels like you have one offer here that is demanding respect. This could be somebody who's toxic or karmic or somebody from your past here who is demanding respect, or they feel like they um shit don't stink, or you know, when they come around you, they act like you're supposed to be like all over them and tell them what like, they're trying to tell you what to do and all that. Like, they just act like they ain't controlling some shit. For us of you, you have um, this next offer here. King of Pentacles in verse. Could be one of these signs, but it does not have to be at all. But, like I said, whoever this person is, King of Pentacles in verse. This person here, they, they ain't got the money. They ain't got a pot to pick in and want to throw it out of. But the love is real. Or the connection is real. It's dire. Or this person here, they can gimme, gimme, gimme. Because they ain't got shit. It's giving good Jody vibes in the reverse. It's giving, like, Jody vibes. Or it's giving, um... What's the movie? Two can play that game. If you ever seen the movie, two can play that game. And that girl, she was with um, what's it was Bobby? What's Bobby Brown? He paid Bobby Brown on the show, and she met him as a mechanic, and he ain't have shit. He was ugly as fuck, and she fixed that nigga up and did all this shit just for him to act like his shit don't stop and go deal with somebody else. Something like that. All right, or they may not be dealing with nobody else, but yeah, they really ain't got nothing going on. They can't see themselves, or they. They need a makeover. 11, 11 on the time set when I said that, when I flipped up my um thing. Y'all, then we got the cancer card shirt at a verse. So there's somebody here who wants to make a move towards you, but they have to make a move towards you, or there's something blocking it from making a move towards you. Then we have the magician card at verse. Somebody could definitely be doing black magic on you to call you in with the love spell. Whoever the fuck this page of cups motherfucker is, okay? Because this magician card at verse is somebody here who does magic, comes to me, spells, or manifestation spells, or tries to call you in, actually project to you, whatever. And for some of you guys here, this could be somebody here who's manipulating the situation as well. Whoever this person is trying to manipulate the situation as well, act like they're the biggest or the best offer, but they're showing up as a page here. You got two kings reverse, a cancer, and then you got a page the patient be on top for somebody out there for us of you if you're not dealing with other options here you don't have you don't have these other options people looking at you i'm here scouting you out like you know how you play sports and somebody scouts you yeah this person here who wants to who's scared of commitment here they feel like this is all that's going on for somebody here for us of you with emperor card here i'm like they want to be the emperor or they see you as somebody who has a lot of pull you have a lot of status you're very wise you know what you're talking about nobody can play you or get not dumb you wasn't born yesterday it's somebody here 1221 and it is 1221 when i'm recording this this motherfucker feel like you're a retired player you're a retired player or like you're a retired i don't even casanova like you talk a good talk or like you retired like I don't know how to explain it. What is this? But yeah, we got the moon card in the bottom of the deck and the Wheel of Fortune card. Lord Jesus. But we have the Queen of Swords reverse here. So like this person feels like you're dead by the Queen of Swords reverse at the same time. They feel like they're the same way, but the Queen of Swords, she told them like, bitch, I'm not to be the one to be motherfucking played with. Like with Queen of Swords reverse, she cool and shit. Don't get me wrong. Once that shit go reverse here, she not play with. She's mad. All right, she gonna speak her truth, stand her ground, and she gonna talk her talk her shit, man or female. You know, but they can also feel like you're somebody here with a lot of money or you do not need this person. That's why they're scared of commitment because they feel like you don't need them or you could do bad all by yourself. All right. Or they could feel like um, while they're behind closed doors or whatever's going on, you could be out and about meeting people. This could be on social media. This could be like at, ho at home, at work. You going somewhere like this person feel like they're always going to have to be in competition, always going to have to be on watch or get other people to monitor you. Okay. Monitor. Literally could be a significance or any type of reptile here, but like yeah 1333 on the timestamp. we have a full card reverse yeah they feel like a fool in love but they could feel like they're gonna be look like at a, as a full play like a fool but we have two of pentacles reverse they feel like you're juggling them or like they're trying to juggle what they should do here and it's giving them a headache or you know it's it's giving them like how do you say an issue like you're like oh my god i don't know what to do like you know how you seen that tiktok and it's like oh my god i've never done this before <laughs> That's what it is, okay? Yeah, they have the two of swords here. This person here, I'm getting like, they have the wool over their eyes here. You know how they say you got the rose-colored glasses on? This motherfucker got the rose-colored glasses on, Aquarius. With the eight of swords of verse, they so in their head over this shit. But the cycle's about to close out for them being in their head and shit, okay? Oh, we have the ten of wands here reverse, And we also have the queen of wands reverse. So, this person here... For some of you guys, they could have heard that you're somebody here who does black, black magic or they feel like you put a love spell on them or a curse on them. Or they feel like I'm really hearing love spell very, very strongly. Okay, this is very funny to me because it's like, huh? What? Huh? Yeah, a lot of had people ask me the same shit. I don't know why I thought it was raining outside, but we, had, we got a 10 of wands at verse. So, 
this motherfucker here, they feel like they're a burden. They will be nothing um, uh, but a burden in your life or bring burdens on getting like, if they fuck you over, if they don't be right, they know the fact for a fact that you'll create every burden possible in their life. Like, I'm here to make their life a living hell. Oh, my God. Yeah, but we have the three cups of verse here. They can feel like you're not loyal or you'll create third parties or they feel like, um... You guys can't celebrate or you guys are not on the same page here. Simply because the four of pentacles, they may need to get their money together. They need to have, I'm hearing they have to undergo a lot of improvements here. Four and three, seven is the divine improvements they need to make. All right. Yeah, because we have the three of wands before you walk out that motherfucking door and leave their ass alone. They know this. I'm getting with the three of wands energy here. They feel like if they don't do what they need to do, if they don't get to your caliber or what you, I'm hearing what you request or what you want here. This is why they're scared of commitment. This is what they're thinking here with the three of wands because they already know. I'm hearing that song, you better put that woman first, you know, Jaheen, okay? Yeah, that's the energy it's giving here because we got the nine of pentacles of earth. They know that you are self-sufficient, but they are not. I'm hearing that song, I don't want show me, and I got it like that, but it don't even got to be like that, <laughs> okay? Y'all feel me, y'all feel me, okay? But, um, yeah, somebody feel like you can have anything in the world that you want, but why them? or why the situation i don't know very like i don't know why they think that but night is what they are rushing in with communication expect to hear from them if you need to but some of you guys here you may not have heard from this person like you guys could be on like a little break a separation all right for others of you i'm getting like this person could be at a distance from you all right for others of you this person here i'm getting like you guys may not be that distant you guys could have seen each other whatever but mentally their mind is in the fucking clouds their mind is is going crazy crash box yeah we have the pisces energy in the reverse the hangman so yeah this motherfucker is in their motherfucking dream world dream state in their fucking mind going crazy i'm hearing sentence um voice yeah see um he you in my business going crazy have him now you mad see my business <laughs> okay um but this motherfucker is in your business okay y'all they're trying to figure out what's going on here and i have the six of pentacles at the bottom of the deck they feel like you're not going to be loyal to them or just get a commitment because nobody has been loyal to them in the past they feel like you are a knight of wands somebody who takes action here you act on your impulses your desires and what makes you happy regardless of anybody else <gasps> y'all i'm crazy so but we have the nine of wands of earth. They feel like you've already made a decision on them or they've already made a decision on you. They are the king of cups here, all right? Yeah, because remember you had the queen of cups come out here. But they've already made a decision. They're the queen of cup, the king of cups here. Great read, by the way. Um, but with the nine of wands of earth, I'm getting like they feel like they've already made a decision. Here. I'm getting like they need to make their motherfucking mind up. <laughs> My bad, y'all. If you want to be a hoe or if you want to be a real nigga. Real nigga is the king of cups. Real is your family. Real is your money. Real is about your business. Real is being emotionally mature. All right. Responsible. Motherfucker. Okay. We have the seven of the verse. I'm getting like the cat is out the bag. Are they finna come and tell you something to confess the truth? Or, you know, um, they're going to ask you if you're being loyal to them. They may even ask to go through your phone. Are you them? Or they already know that, like, you be knowing what they do behind closed doors. So if they even try to do some treachery shit, they did in the past, you already know about it. And if you gave them another chance, cool. But there's a motherfucker on some shit right now. They already know you're going to know about it. You're going to find out about it. But the Ace of Swords, the verse is going to be a hollow victory. Yeah, Justice Carter verse. This is going to be handled. And they're going to get karma. Six of Cups of verse. Yeah, and it's going to blow back in their face. So I'm getting like things that are coming up from the past that they did for somebody out there. It's coming back up. So either they're going to tell the truth now, get right, or get right with you. I mean, it's a lot of heavy Migos energy in here. I'm hearing that song, Don't Lose Me. The song he made about Cardi B, um, Offset. He was a Sag, I believe. We got a lot of we got um a lot of signs here we got libra we got scorpio pisces i know i said scorpio already um aries cancer let me see aquarius we had your card in here as well twice by the way the full card we have libra in here too yeah but all in all, with the four sports verse, they don't want this to end and they don't want you to walk away. I'm hearing that song, we don't want to never end. Ooh. It's like our life is just begin. You walking out, you coming back again. What? What could we be kind of best of friends? What? What? I got all the questions. You got all the answers. I done took your heart, girl. Hold it up for ransom. Y'all, I don't know. This reading is really interesting to me, okay? Like, I'll be having fun on here with y'all. <laughs> I will be going live soon. But, yeah, they know that you're the emperors here. Oh, shit. These cards looking crazy for it right now. So, we have the um, Sagittarius card of verse. They know that you are Earth Angel here, but I'm getting like, they need to know how to work on being an Earth Angel. They're going through an awakening right now, or they're about to. Because they, they, they're realizing that you're the fucking empress here. Or they could have thought that you were, like, somebody evil. Or, you know, I'm hearing, like, whatever people said you were. Like, first... 
I don't care, like, looks can be deceiving, salt and sugar. So, the person could have thought that she was like, oh, they thought she was in the streets. They thought she was evil. They thought she did black magic. They thought that she was not to be trusted. Um, yeah, things of that nature here. But you thought, you the fucking empress. I'm here, like, in the smoke clear. Tamar Braxton, Love and War. Uh, we have a tower card here. So, they already know a tower is coming here. I'm getting, like, a tower going to come. Six force energy if they don't change their mind. Or, you know, you have the ball in your in your court. They feel like um, things are definitely going to end with you guys. Or they will. Um, if they don't get out of this toxic addiction or um, habits or parties or situations here. Whatever it is with the Capricorn card. It could actually be Capricorn as well. But we have a high priestess card. They know that you are the high priest, so you see through everything bullshit. You cannot lie. Uh, they can't lie to you. They need to go through a divine awakening, or they need to, how do you say, do some shadow work here with the Virgo card in reverse, because you're the queen of pentacles, and if not, they're going to get judgment here, and the cycle ain't going to close out. Or young kidding, you both need to do this, possibly, because if not, there will not be a new beginning here. All right, lovers card in reverse. Yeah. So, let me pull this shit up, y'all. Let me pull this shit up. Tattoo, ATL, tattoo. I don't know why I said that. Somebody could have a lot of tattoos here. Somebody could be from the ATL. Somebody could like like skating or something. Or like, you know, they got a big group of friends. Or you do. Who do? How you there? Norbert energy. I don't know why I said that. Y'all, nah, I be getting downloaded and they be crazy. Okay? Lord knows I ain't seen that movie now. I don't know how long. But let's get some cards on this, okay? Let's get some Truth Rising cards. Don't, nah. You're going to do them, but let's do the purple cards first. We're going to do the divination of light and dark, all right? Uh, we're going to do five cards for this spread. Yeah, this motherfucker is scared. They shaking the tables. This bitch is shaking the table, all right? Okay, spirit, spirit just jumped the motherfucking cards. Oh, these cards both came out in the reverse, but spirit of the book reverse, spirit of the staircase. Motherfucker, it's, not, it's like y'all got unfinished business here, but this book about to close if they don't send and level up and do what they need to do. And you too. I'm getting like y'all could be marrying each other for some of y'all. For other of you, it's this motherfucker who need to get their shit together, okay? And if y'all wonder why I got my bonnet on, um, be raining and shit. So I really don't want my fresh press to mess up. But um, yeah, this motherfucker need to vibrate higher. Or get get with the winning team. I'm here to get with the winning team, hoes. Yeah, but we have the crow card that just came out. You know, crows is messengers, all right? They tell you what's going on. They protect you. Or the situation is protected, all right? But some of you guys, all you guys, I'm kidding, like, you need to protect your vibe here. Because this motherfucker could definitely be fucking up your vibe, all right? Yeah, I cut the deck here. So, we have spirit up the snowflake here. So, this motherfucker know you special. You're a place one of a kind, all right? They could be envious here. They know people around them is envious of you, the character, your character, the situation. But spirit of a key, they could have learned a lesson about this or you learned a lesson. Or this type of spiritual significance or solution or wisdom you're going to gain from this situation. You both are. But this person here, and here you go right behind the divine feminine, all right? So, they could have been to a karmic here. Um, or like I said, they could have an uh, incubus or succubus or a lot of things they got to get rid of here. Like, they could have issues with, like, old relationships or, like, you know, this was in the reverse. So, like I said, this person here, they need to get out of this spirit energy, this tragic romance and revenge energy. They need to cleanse their energy and be stripped of this. They have spirit of the possession here. This motherfucker here, they have a sexual obsession here. They could definitely be acting from their lower self. Okay, but here you are, divine feminine, divine masculine, even though it says divine feminine. But, you know, this was going on. All right, so what is six, three, so three, six, nine, that's cool. Let's get a, a last call. Peace, name, raise this song. There we go. So I have spirit of the armor. So this is protected here. I'm kidding. I like, need to have your guard up with this person or they're very guarded here. But I don't know. They could be acting like a wolf in sheep's clothing here for some of you guys. And for others of you, this motherfucker, they want to give you a love offer. But I'm getting like they, they fear commitment, like I said. That's why the love card is in reverse. Okay. Yeah, also, they're reflecting about what's going on here. They could be trapped in a situation at a certain place or with somebody here um, because they didn't pass the test or they're not passing the test here. The spiritual test they're going through a spiritual medicine, okay? So, like this video, y'all. Comment down below, you know. Thanks for supporting your girl. All right, because now we're going to get to the other deck. I ain't never been with a body. They ain't never been with a body, okay? They ain't never been with a body. Anyway, they tried to add you to the tally. I think you add them to the tally. <laughs> Y'all be saying anything on here. Um, let's see what's going on. So, let's get some cards. Like I said, they're coming. Get ready, because here they come. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yeah. <laughs> Don't pay me no money, yeah. I be asking for But, that's it was going on. This motherfucker is your soulmate for some of y'all. 
All right, and then we have the screen card in the reverse. So this motherfucker here, they like, they be wanting to act crazy here, or like they be trying to get your attention, or like they could feel like you go to extremes for attention when you could just be flaunting yourself, or you know, heavy on self love, heavy on self confidence, whatever. But this motherfucker is playing fire with fire. They could be a fire sign, Aries or Sag. Or, you know, they like to go back and forth. Like, you know how somebody said they're going to do something here. All right. Or I'm getting, like, blame game energy. This motherfucker like to play fire with fire. Like, they know what the situation is. But, like, they like to play, play like, around and shit. Like, like, mm -hmm, like play around and shit. Yeah, the hack energy in reverse. This motherfucker's playing around your energy. But, like, not intentionally. Like, not to be rude. But it's like, but you know you got work to do. And that motherfucker want to play ball. You got work to do and you want to play ball. Like, I don't know how else to explain that. You have the screaming card in reverse. Like, this motherfucker here. I'm here, like, they be wanting to scream and shout when you tell them what's right or what to do here or when you catch them on their bullshit. Like, yeah, we have in transition cards. So, you could be in transition here. You tell them they need to get in transition. Or they could be in transition, but it's going extremely slow. Hold on, y'all, because I just dropped hella, hella fucking cards. Hella fucking cards here, okay? So, let's see what else is going on here. And it's so funny when I did that. My fucking flies and shit. My fuckers in my energy. Being nosy and shit. But all in all, you can't trust them at this current time being here. Trust their word. Because, like, they moving out of fear. They moving out of low vibration. Okay. Yeah. All in all, like I said, this person here is moving out of low vibration. Here. This connection could be strictly sexual. Or, like I said, this motherfucker playing fire with fire. They may be lusting over somebody else. Or think this is just a lustful connection. All right, but oh no, you're setting your intentions here. I'm getting like you've already set your intentions and set your sights higher, or you've already said what you will and won't put up with, and you're gonna be leveling up if this motherfucker don't get their shit together, okay? Yeah, we have the setup card in reverse here. This motherfucker either tried to set you up here. I'm getting like whatever setup they thought they had or plan. Yeah, happy relationship here. This was supposed to be happening, but you can't trust them right now. Or you can't trust their word or what they say. You know, people say their word is bond, but all in all, um, <laughs> sorry y'all. We have a tyrant card here. This motherfucker here, um, they're tyrants here. I'm getting like my way of the high rate. They could feel like you're a tyrant even if you're telling them what's real. This motherfucker here, they want to use their own force and control or use their own tactics to try to get their way. But like I said, they need to get checked out or check up or get their shit checked, okay? Yeah, they need to get a check. I'm here like check. All right, but yeah, check please. Mm -hmm. Let's get the bill per. Like that's the energy I'm getting. We have the energy vampire card. Like I said, this person's going to turn into an energy vampire. They don't get their shit together at the bottom of the deck. Single, bachelor, man, or female. Oh, shit. They may drink a lot, smoke a lot, or indulge in aphrodisiacs or low vibrational vibes. Yeah, but because they, they could be listening to a she-devil here who's a malicious or spiteful woman. Or they could be holding it in the back. This could be a lover, a friend, a mother, um, co-worker, whoever this fuck this is. But this person here, they want to live a good life here. But they're not living a good life right now. They could be living paycheck to paycheck. Not having an opinion on a pinto, paylist shopper. All right. Um, they want to be a sunset driver out at night. All right. I'm hearing that song by Michael Jackson, Sunset Driver. Mm, 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 mm. Make me want to go play the Wii game. I love that game. I wonder if I still got that. I need to go see. But anyways, like I said, this person here, they're dealing with insatiable female who's never satisfied or wants more. Or they view you as this because it's like they feel like they're not good enough for you. They feel like they can't satisfy you in any way possible. Or they feel like they can't do what you want them to do. But I have black magic in the verse. They could have been doing black magic at first here. Somebody was the third part doing black magic in the situation. But a backfire that they could have thought she was doing this. All right. Yeah, because their plans didn't work or whatever they thought they were going to have their way. They didn't. All right. And they thought something sketchy was off. But turns out it's just their PTSD here or yours. But yeah, two souls merging into one. That came out in the reverse here. This one fucking here they need to merge it higher than lower self. Because if not, they're going to be in competition with you. Or like they're going to create some type of weird shit going on there could be somebody here who's trying to keep them the vibration who's in competition with you this shady female or male you need to smudge your energy from this person or the situation at this current time being um i look so natural and pretty mm. Mm. i'm so silly but um y'all yeah, this is my favorite jacket if you can't tell i love this jacket like i wash it every week i wear it all the time like it's my favorite jacket but this is my favorite jacket like, it's my tarot jacket y'all but um yeah this is what's going on so, now that we got that out the way, let's get some what's the news cards. All right, let's do five, 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 okay. So, let's get into it. Hold on, y'all. Shit tripping, my hands tripping and shit. Let me give me a feeling, y'all, but I ain't gonna lie. I really have not been feeling like it. Like, I don't be giving me a feeling until they get, like, real long, because I want my nails to be real long. So, I'm probably gonna go next week. But, 
And yeah, let's get some cards on this. Yeah, I just been here talking, but yeah, he got you all the way fucked up, sis. So at this point, I mean, he got you all the way fucked up. Or she got you all the way fucked up. This person here can nickname you trouble or said you was a bad influence. Or I'm hearing that song, hey, good girl, you got a heart of gold. I don't know who that is by. But like I said, this person here wants your power. If somebody here is, is telling you, is saying that you're a bad person or whatever's going on with you. But they're listening to this person here for some of you guys. But this person want to be you. They want your power. They envy you or like, mm -hmm. weird shit. What card is this? Yeah. You're going to see some bullshit. You could already see some bullshit either physically on social media, through a phone, through a message. Or like, you know, your energy, you just feel it be some bullshit. Yeah. You got this card came out, Toxic Relationship. But it came out in reverse here. So like I said, somebody wants y'all to, to think it's a Toxic Relationship that it is the same here. Or somebody wants to put this notion on somebody here. Or somebody could be saying this. What card is this? Yeah, they want you to be miserable as fuck. Whoever the person is who's saying he got you all the way fucked up. I'm getting like, so I want you to be miserable as fuck with this person here because they're trying to manipulate the situation. All right, but yeah, they could feel like they could be telling this person that you're doing the most here or like you, you may care about this person a lot or you help them a lot or whatever. And this motherfucker's trying to act like you're doing things for the worst or for like a get back or something like that, which you're not. I'm not trying to flip your character and make this person scared of commitment. You have the um, Vincent about you call in the reverse. Oh, excuse me. This person is venting about you to... That's a spiritual bird, by the way. Um, that's how you know I'm telling the truth. This motherfucker here is venting to, to you, to, about you to a motherfucker who... How do you say wants to be you or something like that? Like, it's weird. It's weird. Like, the energy is weird as fuck. But we have all over him. So, like I said, in the reverse, you're going to see, like, ain't nobody shaking for him. Or, like... Somebody's intentionally trying to get his information or make you jealous or like create some type of weird ass situation or something to make you mad, piss you off, or get you to act a certain way or drop the whole situation. It's real fucking weird. Okay, real weird ass shit. But next card, we have a perfect match, but we just came out of toxic relationship in reverse. So like I said, somebody's trying to make this or mimic this or make you think this or one of y'all think this. It's giving heavy mental magic. It could be a Virgo because Beyonce's a Virgo. You got Mariah Carey, she's an Aries. Nicki Minaj, she's a Sag. Um, Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie. One of them is an Aquarius. I think one is an Aquarius, one is a Gemini. I may be wrong. You guys can comment that if you want. It's the card I'm looking at, the perfect match. Brad Pitt, I think is an Aquarius. Angelina Jolie, I don't know her sign. She may be an Aquarius or flipped. It's one of them. One of them is an Aquarius. I think it's Brad Pitt, though. But yeah, this motherfucker here, they hiding their pain behind the shades here. All right, or this third party is who, who, who doing all this shit. Hold on, y'all. I'm hearing that song, but I keep on loving you. But I keep on loving you. I don't know what song that is, but I've heard it before. Um, but yeah, this motherfucker is haunted here. They could be haunted um, by their past actions or um, what they thought here of for them agreeing with this person or just haunted by their actions or haunted by their past. Yeah. But they could be um, being urged to keep dating, keep your options open, not be loyal or, like, you know, focus on themselves or just date around or something like that. Somebody could be urging them in their ear about that. But, yeah, this person could have been sleeping on the couch lately or I'm getting, like, sleeping on the floor, sleeping outside the house, in the car. You know, not sleeping in the designated area, wherever the fuck they live. I'm getting, like, somebody could be putting this over this person's head for somebody here. Like, living situation. Yeah, but the last card here, we have unexpected love here. So, like I said, this was an unexpected love. I can't wait to get home so I can call your love. This person's trying to block you out. All right, they're depressed, keeping to themselves, man, a female. Nothing feels better than this. They are not gay. You could have thought they were gay. You could have thought they were happy with somebody else. Or you could have thought they were with their homeboys. <laughs> you could have thought they fuck with their friends or their homeboys more than you, or they always with them or whatever, but... I'm hearing suspicions. Yeah, but we have needing help. This person really needs help here. So they want anybody to think it's possible for needing help. Yeah, but they have mood swings in reverse here. They have a mood swings here. Like I say, you're having mood swings. You both have mood swings here. Things are moody. Things are definitely choppy in the water, okay? Yeah, but all in all, still holding on to each other. You both are. But this person has had enough. Or they're about to have enough. This third party here. I'm getting like, you could have had enough of this motherfucker. And they think that this other motherfucker think they want. Or they stop something. Oh shit. But um 
Yeah, and also somebody could be having court issues, getting pulled over, getting a ticket, or or they could have got one, okay? Or somebody could be having issues with their money, their money could be stolen, jacked, giving it away to somebody or something like that, or getting their money stolen or something. Some of you guys person could have kids here. For all of you, they could be taking care of somebody and or like some type of marine responsibility. Probation or something. I don't know. Some type of responsibility. Let's put it back, y'all. Because now, now, I'm trying to figure out what cards I want to do, y'all, to wrap this shit up. Let me drink some water, y'all. Let's get some, um, not charisma, let's get some characteristic cards. I'm going to wrap this up. Um, this is a real interesting reading, y'all. Go ahead and like this video and comment down below. What that could be in there, my boy. Okay, so. This person could have curly hair or you do. All right. Let's see what's going on here. So my name can start with a T, first, middle, or last name. Okay. Or like, you know, somebody has an apostrophe in their name. Like, like our black names. Let's say, yeah, our black names. Like, you know, like, let's say somebody's name is Trishandra, but you know, Tra, comma, Chandra, or like, something like that. Like, they may, they may not start with the first letter, but it's going to be like after an apostrophe letter. And why I feel need to say that. Somebody could wear cheap clothes, fast fashion. I'm hearing, like I said, didn't I say pay? Didn't I say pay less earlier? Like pay some shit like that, cheap ass shit. Somebody could have an Afro fade, a thought boy, a thought girl haircut, or you know, you know what I'm talking about. Somebody could have plastic surgery, BBL, um, some type of enhancements on their face, body, whatever, um, or you do. Somebody could be Aries or have Aries strong in their chart, or you do. Somebody next start with an M or W. But this is the M card. I think. Yeah, I don't know. Because my handwriting is so bubbly. Here go that damn cancer. Okay. Sun Moon Rising. Somebody got a mustache or a goatee. Or like, when I say mustache or goatee, this could be like this. This could be like this. Or that little, like, you know, niggas who be hoes. They be, not everybody, y'all. But they be having that little... Let me just shut up, y'all, because I'm going to eat my ass up in these comments. I know it. So, I can have spiky hair or, like, have, like, use gorilla snot or, like, something like that. Mm. Somebody could be a Leo. Sun, moon, rising, Venus. So Leo could be a third party as well. When he signs could be a third party, you know, take it how it resonates for you. I'm simply giving a message. The letter U. Y. B, B, W. The letter I. Okay. Quick letter, quick letter I. Mississippi. Okay. Water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, letter B, Virgo. Here go that Virgo. That Virgo. Not Virgo, but Virgo. <laughs> we got a big booty Judy, I didn't tell you that. Um, we have the little O here. Y'all, you see how my TV still trying to play this one song? It still ain't playing nothing. Somebody got blonde hair or like ombre hair. All right. Somebody have beauty marks in specific areas that are noticeable or have beauty marks. My name start with an R. What is this? Somebody has facial tattoos or piercings. Somebody name can start with an A. Somebody got short hair. All right. Oh, shit. Somebody can get perms. I don't know why I just heard. I don't know why I just heard. My hair short because I'm going to perm my hair. Ew. You know how people be saying that? Like, I don't know. Somebody got a short hair. I don't know, y'all. Let me just shut up. Somebody can wear a hat. Okay. Somebody can name start with a P. Somebody can wear wigs or weaves. Oh, shit. Last one, somebody could wear glasses, S, air sign, of course, the Gemini, a C, a Taurus. What's what card is this? Somebody could have high cheekbones. Somebody could be a short person. Short is like five three and below. All right, somebody could be average height, so five four and above. Well, five four to five nine. Okay, and if somebody could start with a V. Pink hair or hair clips or headbands or some type of hair accessory. All right, but um, or somebody could be very hairy or have gray hair, short hair. Again, ponytail, chubby, red car. Yeah. So this is what's going on here, y'all. Hope this really did resonate, and I will see you guys later. Mm -hmm. Check out that description box before you leave. Subscribe, like this card, okay? Not card video must be nice.